Hello. Can y'all hear me? I have no idea what happened. <sighs> Maybe. It might be Twitch. I don't know if it was on my end. Uh, it seemed like Streamlabs was struggling. I didn't close it, and I just went live again. And uh, I think it had issues, because I was like, I'm not muted. So I just closed it and reopened it. All right. Well... With that, I'm gonna be right back, okay? I'm gonna go get another Diet Coke, cause I'm out. But I will, uh, help you with this in a second. Ah, Sanchez is fine. Thank you so much for subscribing. It really helps me out, thank you. There are nice hands. Uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna save this because I, I'm just doing feedback. But anyway, I'll be right back. Uh, for anybody who I guess doesn't know, try and, try and refresh. It is... Alright, I'll be right back, okay? Hopefully people refresh and the stream comes back for them. Because, whatever. <laughs> Maybe I'll change the title to, like, refresh, please. Okay, here be. All right, I'm back. Honestly, I'm just, I hate when that happens, especially when I have no idea what happened. You know what I mean?
right, we lost our cat, but that's okay. All right, see you later, Mooney Raven. Enjoy your dinner. All right. So I assume you're trying to go for like a, an, an iridescent top or dress, I think. Yeah, Rex is one of my OCs. You guys think, I remember seeing a hot take and it was saying like, the word OC is cringe. A little, a little cringe. I don't know. My OC do not steal. I think kind of something though that might be happening is I don't feel like you're, you have some lighting, but I don't quite feel like it's being reflected as well on the, uh, on the character's top. If that makes sense, like, because you have that, like, strong directional side lighting. But I feel like maybe some of it, like, the top of the breast would be hit by that. Finding things cringe is cringe. Thank you. Embracing the cringe is the essence of basedom. With Sonic fans. Oh, so you did come from get about a rep in some parts, but it's gotten better. Okay, yeah. That's kind of what I was thinking. It's like sometimes when I'm typing like on Twitter or something, I'm like, so and so's OC. Like maybe I should have said like original character instead. I don't know. Oh my god, who's calling me? I don't know who that is. I'm gonna just quiet my phone. <laughs> I think it's just the word. Well, but what if it's not a mascot? You know, is every uh, character in a book a mascot for the book or something? Abbreviation is cringe. I was trying to soften this shadow a little bit because I feel like it's a little bit unclear, a little wonky. Or how about this? If hmm. <laughs> So you got a normal lighting, right, coming from the top, and that's why we have this shadow here. And then we have our rim light. Okay. Not entirely sure. I think maybe put the leg a bit more in shadow. On the bottom.
means that you like the confidence you're doing or saying supposed to be cringe thing. Hmm. Did it? Does it? But like, what would you call like Tyrion to like George R. R. Martin? Is Tyrion? Well, Tyrion's a bad example because I think that is literally supposed to be like the semi self insert. Like Cersei, you know? I know, I was gonna be like, bad example. Yeah, maybe it just messed with the lighting a bit. Yeah. I just think that maybe you haven't finished, um, like, pushing it. But it's like that right there. I think that doesn't match with the side lighting you're saying. Because if this part's in shadow, then the knee is definitely in shadow, too. I think kind of what you're trying to describe is that like this all is in shadow. Maybe this part's not. This maybe isn't either. See that I think maybe helps a little bit. But I like the colors, I think. I think it's just because you're doing the two different lightings, you want to just make sure that you are giving enough time to focus on each of them. A million birds start flying around me. Mmm, a sign. He is not a Mary Sue, though. Well, a Mary Sue is supposed to be like a... Is it supposed to be like better? Kind of like an aspiration? I feel like Rex was kind of a Mary Sue then. Like, uh, Mary Sue is kind of like what I wish I could have been like if I had been in a scenario like that. I don't know. Ah, see, but that's not even accurate. Re Rex is just things that I liked and wish maybe I could have had more in my life. Oh. Oh, I see. Characters like that then aren't very fun. Overcompetent, I see. And I fear when I first made Rex, uh, she had a very, uh, very just like normal, like C or D's, I think. But then I interacted with more and more people who liked bigger breasts, and it just kind of happened. But originally, that wasn't the uh, goal. It's... I'm sorry, I am struggling a bit to try and think of what to help with. I think it's... The difference here. And maybe you could have a steeper shadow on the blouse. Because it does kind of feel like unclear that it's um, in shadow. Maybe that already pushes it down a bit. Well, 
One thing, though, I don't know how much you would want to do it. I think you could have a more interesting pose. Because, like, right now, um, the arm isn't very clear. Like, let's see if we can do this again. Wait, where is that? Oh, weird. Oh. Like, your legs are nice and fairly readable, because we can tell, like... Okay, so, for sure, legs are crossed, right? Because we have, like... Know, we can identify the left and right foot, you know, but the hand right now it just we just see like the is it hair or like shoulders that's kind of what we see, but maybe if you had like the hand um which honestly it's not that bad, but like maybe. Like, see, we have a bit more to go off of already by moving the hand out. Okay. Not sure entirely the best way to do the hand if you do want to keep that reaching forward, which I think is good. Um, we add in the side light help define things. back so you could have the other hand catching that light
right? Almost like. like oh, yes. Kiss the hand. To sell stickers at conventions? I don't think I'd be as good at, like, uh, cosplaying Rex as I would maybe be able to like cosplay as like Ramona or Anda. Yeah, just see, like, we kind of can get clarity from this uh, more simplified version. I mean, and you could do, again, the same thing, but have it be readable from lighting that's coming from above, kind of like how you have it. But yeah, just maybe experiment a bit more with the um, posing. Because, again, you have a very, like, she's like like this it's like all up in a single spot that is not quite as readable it's good though but maybe you could push it a little bit more for uh readability i don't know if that helped you i ho hope it did <laughs> But if you don't want to do it, then maybe just try and um, um, deepen the shadows on the dress to kind of have like a similar um, drop in value as like you have here in the skin. Because like if I compare this area that's in shadow versus the area that's lit as a pretty decent little jump upwards, right? But in the top, like the area that is considered lit and then... area that's considered lit versus the areas that are, are in shadow. It's not quite as steep. So you can maybe just, like I said, just make that a little bit more. I don't know, just, just my thoughts. <laughs> You're very welcome. But it's kind of funny when I offer, like, or like when we do these kind of like critique s days. It's interesting to kind of see like there's almost a trend on some days, and I feel like today has been a lot about like silhouette, which is interesting. Like if everybody is just cosmically struggling a little bit more with a uh, silhouette. Nail looks really rough for some reason. <laughs> I love this song. Be wary of using it. Not a bad advice. Uh, 
add that. An extended version. Jolene nails? What do you mean? Thank you. What does overpaint mean? In what scenario? Overpaint is generally painting on the top, right? So that's kind of something I wrote it there. Oh, 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 oh. So in this scenario, I have like all of these layers and they all are doing like very individual things. Um, so what an overpaint for me will be is I will just go to the top of all of these separate layers. Like one is for lines, one is for like all the color. And I'm just gonna go over the top of it and try and make everything a little bit more uh, cohesive. So like maybe I'll do like a few like color splashes to have more of the same color on objects that were separated. So like, I don't know, we could put like this yellow a bit all over her and soften like the lines even. Flip it, of course, so it's not like everywhere. But it's just kind of making things more cohesive. Or like if I wanted to make it look a little bit more painterly. Something I was pondering doing. Well, well, what am I doing? I might cover up this line. And just paint over it. It's my brush. Cover it up. Where am I? Wow, those are pretty. I have an iridescent? I do. Ew. Yeah, just the list is just for me to remember kind of what I think will be the process to uh, finish the picture. Do I have jolly nails? Yeah, they're green. Green and one red one. The reason I did a red one, honestly, they're chipped and I need to redo them. But like, let's see, focus. There are iridescent flakies in the green, and the green's a jelly, that's kind of why it's semi-transparent. Um, but they're kind of reddish, so, I don't know. Weird, like, they reminded me of apples. I don't know. I great. This is shit, stop it. Why did you think this was right? That sounds unhealthy. <laughs> I mean, I say that, but I named this file The Struggle because I was struggling with it. Got my base basic ones, blue ones. 
Honestly, that one looks the coolest. Maybe I just changed the color of it. Wait, is Photoshop okay, okay? It's Photoshop, yes. Sorry, I definitely missed that. Can you or will you add more gloss uh, to like everything or just like the lips? I probably will, just a bit more sheen. Your burger's finally here, nice. Yeah, this is the Chemical Brothers. We do like that. I mean, the blue looks good. I'm trying to do like a pink, but... All right. I don't know. They kind of don't look good. Unfortunate. Those ones just look good. I should just do a yellow or something. Don't look good. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, yeah. I don't know if I do. Uh, not really. Not not so much better. Also, my light is like very bright. I think it's because the sun went out. Went out. I'll adjust it. Thing is, this one just looks so. 
change these colors for like that just don't look good I mean that looks more interesting I don't know. Do I? Yeah. It's been a minute though since I have. Here's my lighting. I'll always sit here. Come on. Do -do. Kind of better. Being like blinded too. Oops. Now I'm in the dark. <laughs> You're back and fat. Was it good? Also messed this up. But I did. I don't know, they're not going very well together, but it makes sense. And we just do purple nails. Get all purple ish. See, that doesn't even, doesn't look good. Merge it back. Just not do it like this. I think we're going with jellies. No, no. Go just dark purple and be done with it. Yeah. 
Yeah, I did like the aqua because of that too, but um, I don't want to add the color aqua because I feel like I already kind of have like a set of colors for this picture. Like that's why I was trying to go for yellow or purple. Life ain't a set of colors. Yeah. Is that your fish tank? It is. I don't like it. See, this one just looks so good. Sucks. Just go to Google and look for like some cool nails. Uh, jelly, gel, manicure. Maybe we just put little like stars in it. Cause like, this is the type of manicure I was kind of thinking she would have. Copy. See? So it's just, it's simple. They would just be like, all jelly. Um. But, you know, you love me some French tips and these ones look cool. Also, I'm now seeing, like, in the past, I tried to do these on her, and it didn't look right, but I think it's because, like, in this one, you can kind of see there's almost a glow to them. I need to make sure I try and, like, that. I like those, so maybe we just do those. Go handicap yourself? What do you mean? You think I'm trying to, like, limit myself? You gotta go? Alright, well, thank you for hanging out. You're... <laughs> Yourself lie. Some people glue stuff on them and you could, uh... Add a Statue of Liberty on them? Yeah. But the reason I didn't do that is because I think that would be hard. I think that would be hard to draw. 
like a bunch of little stuff on it. My layers are out of hand, by the way. I mean, those already look pretty neat. You know, if I had like hella money, maybe I would also have like crazy nails. I tried for a bit to like go get my nails done, but then like they ruined my nails. And uh, it was too expensive. Also, I realized why this looks weird. Because it's on top of all my other lines. How long have you had your nails grow? I mean, at least an inch. Of like natural nail and wear gloves. I mean, you'd be surprised because a lot of them wear gloves, like uh, nail technicians, um, and they all have like pointy, crazy nails. I mean, they do poke through, and then you gotta like switch them out and such, but they they do. I don't know, do we try and do like a yellow? I don't know if we do. Because those ones look so cool. They're darker in the middle. They're hard. If you force it widescreen, huh? That is something I kind of wish that you could zoom out more. Finished a piece recently. If you aren't too busy, I would, would you mind taking a look at it? Yeah, absolutely. Just uh, post it in feedback and then let me know. Yes, hi, welcome. Yeah, to contaminate cells, probably not worth it. You prefer sharp or flat? Uh, you mean like squared or point? I'd like the points, but um, my nails keep breaking, like my natural nails keep breaking if I do squared, which I like a lot. Oh, I assume in the display options, gotcha. I 
like it, but I am playing it already. I remember this piece. I'll pull it up in just a sec. Those are cool. It's okay. Um, that's what you're gonna buy, but yeah, the paladin seems pretty interesting. Let me see. <clears throat> Do you remember the feedback I gave you on it? Maybe I should go find. Ah. Uh, like where this is its progression, I guess. Let's see. Search for you. Oh. Old. Oh, 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 oh. Um. There we go. Really? What am I maining? I don't know yet. I have a bard that I was having a lot of fun with. Um, and what else? I think it's a shadow, shadow blade I made. Um, but I'm not entirely sure if I am uh, liking that one. I'm not used to playing like maybe the, uh, what do you call it? I'm sorry, I'm like looking for something, so my brain is like numbing out. I just feel like my character is moving a lot, and I was struggling with that. And like doing the abilities and having to like scoot up close enough to the enemy and use the abilities. Uh, Lost Ark. Sorry, I'm gonna grab it this real quick if I can find it there it is okay so you completely changed the arm yeah oh thanks <laughs> I just found it too what made you want to change the uh, arm oh, sorry the pose it's good, I think, the change. Mostly I just didn't think the pose was very natural.
Um, well, one thing with this is, I think when you put your arms like behind yourself, it's more comfortable to like leave them a little bit like lower, if that makes sense, versus like up high. Because if you do up high, it's like that's generally kind of forced. So like you might. I know you're kind of going for like maybe a more of a graphic look with this. This might like disrupt that a smidge, but I would say this might be more comfortable if it was like lower. But then you're in a predicament with like, how do you end that shape off? It's not tucked behind them. You can see that. Yeah, so I'm not sure how you'd want to approach that. Um, that's like a single thought. Mm. I don't know if it's intentional or not, but uh, forearms are just a bit long. And you have a tangent potentially there, unless they're pulling something from behind them. But I think that's already a little bit better for like the length. My main concerns are the face sh uh, shapes and the shadow, though. Okay. Let's. Uh, I mean, you don't have a lot of shadow. Like, you have this. And I assume if you want to keep, like, a, like, kind of, um, a hard cell shade look. Got lighting coming from up here, right? I think, for the most part, I think it looks pretty good. You might have some more directional lighting under the nose here. Under the chin. I think all this horn would be in shadow on that part.
Gotcha. Okay. I don't know how. I would maybe just separate those two a little bit because that might not be entirely clear if you wanted to. Um, but no, I think it's just maybe increase some of the directional lighting. If you want it to be maybe a little less dark, you could have like the top of the eyelid getting a little bit of lighting, assuming it's coming out a little bit more than everything else. Well, that's only if it is out. It's, don't do it. Don't. Never mind. You want to have the shadow on the nose too maybe have it but it might not be necessary do you have the asaro head or have you seen the asaro head yet Sorry, I'm going to set up an Asaro head, I think, to the angle I think you have. Why is that not working? Okay. Assuming they have similar face planes to like a human. That's kind of something you would want to look for. So. Kind of what you have is pretty simplified, which is fine. But you could have like a sense of highlight somewhere. But like. The nose. Like here, usually it sticks out a bit. Like the top of the forehead dips into the nose a bit. You can go with like the Rembrandt-esque.
if there was a highlight, it would hit like this part of the f nose a bit. You almost finished off the Demon Lord. But, um, uh, Scott, if you ever wanted this like reference thing that I pulled up, it's pinned in the art related tutorials. And what you can do is you can rotate the head, whatever angle you're drawing, and you can like hit play and pause and move the, uh, the light around and like figure out, um, what would be probably accurate at whatever angle you're doing. And then you can see like the simplified planes of the face. It's hard to convey, it's actually. Do you want it to look like hair? Is that what you're saying? Or do you want it to look more reptilian? It's like, maybe if they like, if you imagine they hang down like hair, but maybe you could, uh, if they're kind of like, I don't know if they're like tentacles or like, dragon whiskers, but you could maybe have them like. Move a bit more. Maybe. Gotcha. Are some of the biggest struggles? Well, I think it looks good. Let me look back. I think on the old one, you didn't have any. So I think it's definitely... You've improved. But I'd say, like, if you're trying to go for more cell shading, then don't worry about like that second tone. Just have, well, have like your local, your shade and then a highlight probably. And that's it. You don't have to like paint it if you don't want to. Let me send this back. And you're welcome. But yeah, I think once you get more comfortable, I think thinking about lighting, it'll, it'll obviously get a lot easier. <clears throat> I changed my music. What do I want to listen to? I think this song was like kind of fun, but.
put that almost nothing. Man, they're just not reading how I think I'd like them to. Go with white, yellow ones. Maybe. Those aren't bad. Yellow is one of those hard colors to, like, darken. Ever, are you upset? Bird is happy? Maybe I just leave them. You know what we'll do? We'll go towards the light. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Bunny reference is adorable. It's pretty cute. <sighs> it's quite chunky. Bird cam missing. We haven't had bird cam in many months. Pretty much when I got Abra, I waited like a few months until after I got him to set up a cam, and then I immediately like, got rid of it. We're not listening to more of this type. I'm not jamming. It's usually your go-to. a bunny and a rabbit for the most part it's just the same thing i think i think rabbit could maybe be used to refer to a uh well maybe a hare is different than a, a rabbit but i think a rabbit and the bunny are the same <clears throat> did i lose connection again no maybe music stop i guess i did that <laughs> i was like is that what happened hold on i have to send a text say 
do whatever is responsible. Like, is it irresponsible to buy the equipment? Maybe not. I don't know, like, your financial situation. But if you have the extra money saved already somewhere, um, then there's probably no harm in getting the equipment. I don't think I want to listen to Tame Paula either. Jakey. Yell could be nice. I feel like we've gotten nothing on this thing done. I mean, the nails are technically done now. Took just ages. Edges are clean enough. <sighs> Render the clear stuff and done. Add spots. We did that. Did we just color lines? Maybe that's what's next. We just set it to multiply. Personal health might be a better viewpoint. So, I don't. I know that it's a, a, a bit on the inappropriate side, what I understand. <laughs> yep. Uh, very explicit, yeah. You now I opened a Coke and I wasn't fully done with the other one. But now I have a cold one and a warm one, which, you know, ain't the best. <clears throat> I mean, I just do all of it and go in and clean it after.
Is Suzanne on our answer? Hey, sheep. Love her nails. Thank you. I was struggling with them and I gave up and just... I was trying to do ones like this, but I don't know how to render that at the moment, so... I give up. <laughs> so they're just yellow. Will you get your tax return on Tuesday? I heard um, people were having like difficulties or like the IRS was supposed to be slow about getting people their money. Man, I feel so weird. I'm, I think, looking more and more forward towards going to just see if everything's okay. Because, like, the breathing thing and it's smelling or feeling weird. Really weird. Oh. Hopefully it's juicy. Okay. Oh, good luck. <laughs> Hope it goes well. Whatever way you want it to. Oh, you know what we didn't do is we never rendered the lines. So maybe we do that after I finish like this little part on our shirt. I didn't know how long I was streaming before uh, everything cut out. I usually use that as a basis. I'm like, has it been like almost four hours that I look I'm like an hour and 20 minutes? How the heck? Oh, we've probably gone about hours, right? That's how that works.
one thing about this picture is I don't know how clear shadow and lighting is reading on parts of it. Fine. Don't worry about it. It's fine. I was about to be like, what did I say I was going to work on? Let me try and see if I can find um, the material. I think it's supposed to be reflective, I guess. Uh, I don't know. I haven't like properly recorded just like from start to finish, I guess. And these clothes are so cool. Hmm. Uh, sorry, the name of that last song? I, I don't know how to say it. <laughs> it's gonna be like, well, this is how you say it. I don't know. I think maybe. Trying to learn French. Oh, is that what the name of the song is? Because of voice. I tried to learn French when I was still in. I guess I was in like an online school. Didn't go great. <laughs>
don't think so. I might let Ira out. Right in front of me. What's on the menu tonight? I don't know yet. Something I need to think about uh, kind of soon. Nothing's planned, though. <laughs> I think I have, like... No, I have kitchen. I have chicken in the fridge. Flash, mm hmm. One also, like, uh, there's like a lot of sounds I feel like that, like, almost get cut off. Like, I don't even know what I would say if I were to try and say it. Like, this atuta, no, I can't. <laughs> I can't. But there's like, ugh. There's like sounds that you guys kind of like just like it's just dropped off, I think. But that's hard. To, um, at least that was hard for me to like try and figure out how to do. He's maybe you can see him. I read. Come here. He's marching across the floor. Um. <laughs> Looking for fallen seeds. Are there all languages? Japanese has been much easier. But it's because, like, I don't know, once you learn the hiragana, it's like those sounds just make those sounds, right? There's not a lot of, like, guesswork for how to pronounce it, because, like, you learn it, it makes a sound. Okay, Divine. Uh, thanks for your Sorry. I understand. Work was... If work was, like, taking your attention. If you ever want more help or something, you can let me know. I wasn't entirely sure what was the best advice. And then decided that they weren't needed. Yeah. <sighs> Like, here, let us spell out, like, this word, and then not say that. All birds on the chair. That's my nose ring, sir. No, I don't. I wouldn't know how to say that, 2K. Like, just English, trying to pronounce it, you know? Like, have you not seen me constantly struggle with people's names? I feel like I should try harder to learn another language. 
Alvin offered to help me learn Japanese, so I should take him up on that, I think. Put what on? Oh, 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 wait. Oh, zoom out, they mean. Hold on, let me put her eyes back on. Full screen bird. Ever step up. Step up. He don't wanna. He's being rebellious. Step up. Step up. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Oh, no, no, no. Jumped onto my hand. That's trying to get him a seed. Thank you. Hey, step up. There you go. You little shit. Flip. A wave. He's gotten much better at his waves. Yep. Ben. Hang. Yep. He doesn't care about your mirrors, no. Wave. Wave. No, he knew for the day. No. He gets his breakfast. Well, I guess it's like his meal. And then he gets like snacks and other seeds I hide about in his cage. All right, let's go play. You know, one thing about birds, especially parrots, I guess, is like they hold their seeds. So whenever I give him like a seed as a treat, there's just like a bird mess now. <laughs> How many times do I need to wave? He's good at the flip. He's very cute. He wants to pull on my nose ring though, so I'm a little afraid of letting him too close. I love you. Pretty bird. Is it? He's very cute. I love him. Much. really is the good boy. Oh. You guys, um, I don't know about anybody else, but like, do any of you guys listen to like, like, like music and languages you don't understand? Like, do you guys enjoy that? Yes, okay. 
Average amount of time you spend on your pieces, I understand complexity can vary. Uh, I have no idea. I need to try and be more diligent and record it. I, I think at the moment I've been afraid of the answer. So, um, I haven't like tried to record it because I don't want to know. But uh, I'll pull it up. This picture to get here took me a few hours. But it was quicker than I had anticipated it to be. It's been quicker than like any other set of lines I've done recently. I don't know about that. I think I was just more direct. I think I knew what I was looking for a little better than I do with a lot of my other pictures. Invested in line work. It's been like that for a bit, unfortunately. Or like, my line art has kind of improved. It's not improved where it's like, I love it. It's just... I don't know. It's my stronger set of skills right now than like painting. Most fa bands of from Shiner non German. That's honestly the band I was thinking of when um I was asking because like my family had listened to like a lot of Rammstein when I was growing up. Um, but like one of my like my sister, she learned how to speak um German because she liked it so much. Welcome back. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you just posted some? Man, I miss going to the gym. I'm gonna have to get back into it here soon. Hmm. You just finished doing your, your workout? Nice. I'm 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 envious. You look like you're gonna jump on my face. Good feeling, don't lose it. Wanting to go back? Or you mean getting back into the routine? Mm, what you doing? Can I grab my new string? Run along. Fly away. Oh. Everett. <laughs> Oh, yeah, he attacks my pen. 
Here, you're being distracting. I'm trying to draw. Ah, Bikaki! Welcome! Thank you for the raid. Bees, how's your stream? I am distracted by my bird who's trying to pull on my nose ring. He might poop on me. Beware. For anybody who doesn't know Bukaki, their art is amazing. Very uh, quality renders, as well as some uh, blur art. A sexy satyr gal. Oh yeah? Would you like to share it with us? I'd love to see it. No, no, no bother though, if you don't want to. I know that, uh... I feel like Calvin has gotten me, like, used to me usually not try like, trying to send him the picture. I'm in the black and white rendering stage. Oh my goodness, that is so beautiful. See, that's what I mean, y'all. What are you doing? Oh, did he? Let me pull it up on stream. Your faces are so, like, realistic. It's so good. Oh, do you see this? Cute little satyr booty. <laughs> satyr beauty. Booty, oh my god. Little ears, too. It's looking gorgeous. I love the hair. Thank you for sharing. Yeah, no, it's just so beautiful. Maybe it's just because it looks like it's at a tavern, but it gives me, um, Witcher vibes. <laughs> like, uh, one of my friends is playing it, and it's like, it kind of, the face reminds me a bit of, like, just the game faces on, like, Yennefer, I guess. And furry ears, those are the cutest ears. You pull on me. This is a sketch with the rough colors. Ah, oh, yeah, that is so cute. So, do you start with colors and then convert things to grayscale? Are they like kind of yin and yang? You never do anything the same way? I feel that. <laughs> feel that. Well, it's looking gorgeous. I can't wait to see when it's finished. My, I use a color to determine the values. Then desaturate so I can work on my values. Gotcha. I've I've definitely tried to do grayscale several different ways. Um, I feel like I've learned that doing it kind of more like a like a sculpture, I guess, tends to be the easiest for converting it back to color. But I like working the values. I feel like you like learn more Uba.
Hi, are you enjoying flying all around the room, sir? You want to step up? Step up. Down. He's ignoring me. I hit start with the base colors. Yeah. Honestly, I I just don't know. Like I think um you're probably familiar with them cuz they stream on Picardo too. Uh Calm Draws. I think I've seen them work the values and then go into color too. I'm always just blown away though with that. I can never figure out how to do it well. I am to sleep, so I'll be heading out. I'll have a good night. Thank you for hanging out with us. You know what I bet you it is? When I've done it, I had um, not done the colors first. Like I didn't start with the colors and then switch to um, sat uh, desaturated. But that makes more sense because a lot of times when I've done that, I picked the wrong value for trying to go for the color I want. Also, oh my goodness, another raid, war, war mics. Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome. <clears throat> he reworked his on so people who tip get all of the art from the past. Oh, I see. Now there's a party. How was your stream? Oh, thank you. Three bucks for everything. Yeah, I'm gonna maybe need to go do that because. I love calm, sorry. Oh, you want scratches? What a sweet bird. You wanna step up? You're falling asleep. Oh, well, thank you for hopping in here. Um, I hope you sleep well. And enjoy the rest of your day. All right, I guess night. <clears throat> yeah, I appreciate y'all coming in here and raiding me. Palm's art, though, is one like I've definitely studied a lot to try and improve my own. Alright, can we do something in. What am I looking for? I don't even know. Is it linear? I've been making a lot more like weird uh, word sounds lately. Like squawks, I guess. Random squawks. Maybe I'll try this. Copy. Yes. Do a multiply. Hmm. Anything? Oh, you know what I should have done? I'm gonna undo it. Hold on. I messed up. This one to multiply. I don't know.
I've seen people do it with gradient maps. I Holy color range. You squawk at me. Oh, yeah, here we go. What? I love you. What? I feel like that's looking more how I want it to. So cute. The burb. He's very sweet. <laughs> I'll make the shrimp sit on the shoulder. That'd be sad. They like can't hold their like bodies uh out of water. Like they kinda like shrivel up and like I don't know. I can't, like, walk at all. Okay, okay. Um, that's kind of cool. I need to add more variation though over here. I was like a fish out of water. I guess that's a good point. Well, that looks at least fine. Cool. That looks holo- well, I mean not holographic, but it does look reflective. We add noise to it now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We maybe blur it slightly because I don't want it to be so sharp. Oh, wait, it's locked. Okay. Okay. What will we do? I think what we need to do is make this white because I want that to be the light color. Well.
Okay. Try this. Okay. All right. We're getting somewhere. <clears throat> hey, Fusion Tech. There's some happy shrimp. You ever add like shadow area for like the middle area of you? <laughs> you know? No. Nice. All right, all right. Let's see. Now maybe we add another mask. No, another adjustment layer. This one will be uh, a selective. No, that's not it. It'll be a. All the color. Avra, please don't attack my girl. Doing all right. How are you doing, Fusion Tech? Hey. No, that's not what I should have. Balance. I get it to be a nice yellow. Doesn't look as good as the other yellow, that's for sure. The pink doesn't look as good. We just don't do yellow. that look good? I don't think it Good. I hope work went well. And I feel like maybe my colors weren't the best choices. Hmm. 
All right, I'm just trying to figure out how to do this. Oh, thank you. Usually use a gradient map. So maybe I use a gradient map on top of my gradient map. Maybe. Reselect. Maybe let's start with the group. Select the actual. Hmm. So this other way. Now I'd like maybe a white or something. Oh, you're flying so fast. Sorry, using Photoshop. They'd be like, y'all should shout at me or something when I'm like missing too many comments, but can't. <laughs> Abra. Don't cry. Hmm, maybe that'll work. Okay, let's, before I do it, let me.
okay, okay. <laughs> Sorry. I just wants to be on stream. He can he can be on stream if he wants to. His cage is open. I don't know if this is how I should do this one. Reselect. We'll just do a... Yeah. Is that what we wanted? <laughs> Maybe. adding noise <laughs> yeah parrots are very needy like 100% needy you want a snack And you're learning? Well, nice. A bunny ref pick. I think I just pulled it up so people would maybe be able to connect those dots a little better. All right. Um, you know, I'm not sure if I like it. I only have a lot of things going on in this picture. You know what? Hmm. Is that not working?
There we go. I think that's actually what I intended to do, is not have all of it be reflective. However, the pink looks cooler. I don't know. Is it easy for lines to stick out? Maybe desaturate them? Uh, it's okay. I'm not too worried about the lines. Just leave it silver. <laughs> Maybe I'll merge these. No, not yet. Not yet. What? Oh yeah, my brain. All right, what is this layer? I have no idea. What am I doing? Is that this one to... Why? Good grief. No, that doesn't look right. This? Over. I'm going to take a minute because I'm losing my mind. All right. Um... You like it? 
a nice draw. How you can add the shadow on the white lines. Uh, and it carries over to the color. Mm hmm Well, it's like adding a multiply layer on top. So the color is being applied to, like, the one underneath. I don't mind the silver, but I wanted it to be yellow. So I'll try for yellow. Play with us. It looks godly. What do you mean? Have you put a gradient map over the yellow that goes from yellow to pink? Hmm. That's an interesting idea to have it, uh, have it be both yellow and pink as like the color. An idea. I like it, but. I kind of like having this. So the idea is that the middle strip would be the reflective tape and the pink would just be uh, like a cotton fabric. Okay. Well, the reason I don't really want to do white or silver because it's based on, this whole idea is based on this lumpy space princess and she doesn't really have silver she has yellow like a yellow star so kind of the vibe i was trying to go for I don't know. You see the likeness? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I still add spots to the clouds. I don't know. What I was trying to do that I like was getting frustrated with, lost my mind, is I was just trying to apply my normal values that weren't being a, like on, affected by the one that's making it look kind of holograph not holographic but like reflective um and what happened i don't know i just like duplicated the layer maybe it deleted part of i needed you love the ear gauge thank you from the previous piece thank you They've changed a lot. I think this was this was my second remake and then this is like the newest one. They've changed a lot. <laughs> but I like the spots on this jacket a lot. And I'm tempted to apply it to like the uh cloud because I think it looks really cool, but I try and brave trying to adjust this again. The thing is the white looks good too. And the white is like the most normal color for like the reflective. I don't know.
why it's not bad because i think you made a good point that it matches the hair that's not bad the hair level up uh there's sub only emotes that i want to add okay well thank you um let me see if i got it did you do it a while ago or just now i don't think i see it yet how do you where where do you do it how do I get to your wardrobe spot? Go to the website. Okay. I see it. I don't think I cr it currently thinks I'm subscribed. I don't see a notification on Twitch for it. So I don't know if it happened yet. Did you give it to the correct powder puff? Let me refresh. I don't see it. I feel like I would see it in the little notification. Maybe I'll give it a minute. All right, we'll leave it silver. Maybe we make the jewelry silver. Maybe we just have the yellow star on her eyes, face, and nails. Because honestly, silver maybe would look better, you know? Okay, don't inverse. There we go. Okay. Oh, I see it. It. Wait. I am the one and only. Uh oh. Uh, do you see what that link was? Because I don't know. Was it was it okay? Was it was it a bad link? Oh, it was a bad link. <clears throat> Honestly, you guys see these layers? It's giving me anxiety <laughs> because there's a lot of them, and I can't merge a lot of these. I could maybe group them, but they're a mess. And I'm stressed. I don't want to deal with them. Collapse it. Halo.
Okay. Maybe I try and adjust. Ah, yes. Thank you again, Fusion Tech. It's just glue. <laughs> okay, I don't know. This one. This one? No. Oh, wait, wait. That is it. All right, all right. Happy. Saturate. Oh, not as spectacular looking. Yeah. Holographic. Oh my gosh, I keep saying holographic. The reflective look. Eh. Okay. I don't know. Maybe it looks good. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. I feel like that was a big old headache. I still have to color the line. It look good, though. I don't know. I'm doing stop. All right, all right. It's pretty readable. That's good. Thank you. <clears throat> all right. I think since we kind of figured that stuff out, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to call it here. Um. Well, solo switch, lucky for you, it might just be a sticker. Um, so I gotta just, you know, figure out that whole process. That's amazing, thank you. I don't think this is done. Sorry, let me rephrase. I'm gonna be done streaming for the day. This is not done. Um, I'm trying to think. What all I want to do to it? I think I want to put some. Maybe we'll just do a mock up of what it would take. I kind of wanted to have like some more stars floating around. You know, but maybe a little bit nicer of a shape. Maybe one like lodged in the cloud. I don't know. That could be fun. Ramona with a big gulp in the background corner. Maybe for uh, a different picture. Like, maybe for this one or something. 
Honestly, I should try and do a picture like this of Ramona where she's standing. Maybe I use the same perspective grid I used for this one so I can maybe like just transfer all of my characters in and they actually all look like they're standing together. That could be, that could be clever. Maybe we do that at some point. <laughs> but yeah, I guess slap some stars in there, maybe put like little rainbows around it, you know? I don't, I don't really know what else I would really want to do unless I want to try and overpaint on parts of it. Maybe we add like uh, that uh, green tone texture on parts of it. Maybe that's cool. I don't know. We will figure it out. But for now, thank you guys for hanging out with me. Um, I'm not entirely sure when, when I'll be streaming. I, I might continue and just stream on Saturday, but if I don't stream Saturday, then I'll stream on Friday. So tomorrow, but I'll know more tomorrow. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and watching, following, subscribing. It means a lot and helps me out. Thank you DeviantArt for sponsoring our stream. Um, I'm gonna go raid Charmy. Because I haven't had it, I don't, maybe I've gotten to raid Charmy like oh, one other time before, but that'll be fun. I'm the best? Oh my, thank you. <laughs> also, well, no, I guess I'll see you all before Valentine's Day, right? Speaking of that, I have a picture. Uh, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to be clever and I'm going to post my um my holiday Rex picture as a Valentine's Day picture. So I got to slap some hearts in there, you know, to really sell that vibe, you know, and not that it was like a, a Christmas picture, you know. That'd be clever. Cause I definitely missed Christmas, so maybe we just use it for uh, Valentine's Day. I'm wondering if I should change the color of like the the white and maybe make it pink so it's less candy cane and more like you know i don't know valentine's day i don't know anyway thank you guys again for hanging out with me and let's go say hi to charmy they're working on i think they call them their tank girls they look awesome they're in like really cool uh like rave almost aesthetic and cyberpunk vibes they look really cool um, what else? I don't, I don't think I have anything else to say to you guys. All right. Looks like y'all are all packed up and ready to go over there. So, oh, wait, wait, y'all. Wait, we need, we need our raid message. Uh, uh, mm, raid. How that works? No. Thank you. Completely spaced out on what to do for that. Thank you. All right, let me copy that and I'll see y'all next time. Bye you guys.